Hello, welcome to Tech Select. Linus is the name. Thank you so much for joining me on yet another exciting video. Now, I landed on a company that is dealing in fixing the problem we have with plastics. Now, I did get to catch up with gentlemen uh, from a company called Taka Taka Plastics. Interestingly, the word Taka Taka, when you get it from Swahili, just means something like rubbish, something spoiled, you know, something like that. It's, it's basically loosely translated as rubbish. So Taka Taka in Swahili is basically rubbish. Now, these particular people are called Taka Taka Plastics, and interestingly, they get the, you know, the, the plastics from the rivers, from the roadsides, from the trash bins. They pick up all those balls bottles, broken bottles, jerry cans, and all that stuff. And then they remold them and upcycle them and make new products that can be reused on the market. Now, I did catch up with Emmanuel from Takataka Taka Plastics, and this here is what he had to say. Hello, my name is Obete Emmanuel. I am the Community Engagement and Partnerships Coordinator at Takataka Taka Plastics. Takataka Taka Plastics is a social enterprise based in Gulu and uh, we are locally collecting the plastic waste from the drainages and landfills and communities of Gulu City and turning them into usable products such as uh, these, these coasters. Uh, now the use of this coaster is so that you can just put your drink uh, on top of it so that you don't you know mess up the entire table and uh, this is basically from broken jerry cans and bottle tops and stuff like that and we're also using that exact type of plastic to uh, make plastic sheets such as this. This is 12 kilograms of shredded plastic melted into this plastic sheet. Now, after here, we are cutting these plastic sheets into various shapes and sizes so that we are able to make things like that beautiful chair you can, you can see right there. We also have a folding chair like you see a gentleman sitting on, a foldable table and then another size of plastic chair. Now, we are also cutting that, uh, that uh, plastic sheet to make learning aids for children and uh, phone stands and laptop stands. But of course, uh, we come from Gulu and uh, we couldn't carry everything. However, we have a product catalog that I can share with you and then you'll see the other various um, uh, products that we are making. Now, we are working on the PET plastics. The, P the PET plastics is the hardest type of waste. Like It is the biggest challenge we have right now. But uh, in the cities of Gulu, we are collecting all those plastics and turning them into construction wall tiles. This is a wall tile, 100% from plastics. It's harder than ceramics. It lasts longer than ceramics. You could drop this right now and it wouldn't break. I can transport this to you in Kampala from Gulu and not a single one will, will break in transportation. Yeah, and also it doesn't absorb water like the ceramic tiles do. And relatively cheaper, yeah. So a box of uh, these uh, Taka tiles goes for 45,000, but in that box is 1.5 square meters of tiles. That means if you do the calculation, it means one square meter is 30,000. We have Richard contacts. You could contact me or any other number that I will share with you. You could also contact the sales department, which I will share with you. Uh, however, we don't have an outlet in Kampala at the moment, but we are working on acquiring a shop uh, within the city so that our customers just have to go to that, to that shop. But for the meantime, when you order, we deliver it to you in Kampala. We have uh, done business with so many people in the central region here and other parts of the country as well. For example, recently we concluded a uh, business with Bidibidi. It's a, it's a refugee uh, camp in, in West Nile. Yeah, and we, you know, ship, ship the plastic uh, tiles to them and help them also to, you know, install the tiles. So we, we can ship, we can transport the, the tiles, so that, that shouldn't be a problem. Um, to everyone watching, uh, the problem of plastic waste at this point in time should be community, community responsibility. It should not be left alone to, you know, people who are trying to recycle. You could take the first initiative by, uh, you know, trying to sort your plastic at home and disposing it off in a, you know, a proper way, not just throwing it and burning it everywhere. But otherwise, I hope we all live long enough to see a plastic-free community. And uh, yeah, have fun. Well, there you have it. Uh, of course, uh, it is Taka Taka Plastics, www.takatakaplastics. You can go check them out, check out the stuff they do have. Um, they have amazing products. Actually, I was... Uh, testing out a few things of theirs um, on at, at the grounds there at Kololo and I was actually amazed like for, for instance the chair um, the top 
of the chair looked like it would easily fall in and of course the person on my weight and above uh, i did test them thoroughly and i must say they were actually uh, you know sturdy enough for me to bounce all over them and they did not break some of the things to show that you know what uh, ugandan products can be made out of anything and of course if you are creating a solution to a problem that we are facing then big ups to you now of course you can just check them out www.takatakaplastics.com why i'm saying this over and over again is we have got to support our very own especially innovators that are coming up from the country and are trying to figure out solutions to problems we are facing in this here country so check them out you know buy their products the wall tiles actually do look amazing and uh, a lot more laptop stands phone stands and then reading materials if you're school reach out uh yeah do reach out um well thank you so much for watching this video make sure you're subscribed and of course hit the notification bell so that you are alerted each time i drop a new video of course lots more videos are uh, from the national science we could be dropping on this channel so you might be uh you might want to be alert and are waiting for that to drop at any time any moment but as for today let's call this one a wrap and i shall see you in the next video bye bye